Hey water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those of you cross-watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. In today's reading, we're going to take a look and see what is meant to be for you in the near future. So we'll go ahead and take a look and see what's destined for you, who are you destined to cross paths with, what messages do the cards have for you. It is going to be a general reading, guys, so please keep that in mind. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. My email address will be listed below the video. Interesting. I'm seeing a pattern here, guys. I see that you have a decision to make. I see that there is something that's been weighing heavily on your mind. And this is something that you've been giving a lot of your energy to. This is something that I feel like you've been going back and forth. A lot of you are at a crossroads, okay? There is a reason why you're feeling whatever it is that you're feeling um, an energy of um, uncertainty an energy of confusion an energy of anxiety okay um, you might be feeling afraid to make this decision this decision um, might be very big for you um, it may be a choice or a decision that you've never made and you're not familiar with um, let me tell you, this is very important because this choice that you've, or this decision that you've been weighing up is going to alter and it's going to change your life forever. The direction uh, of our lives is often determined by the choices that we make each and every day. So when you think, and some of you might be thinking, you know, some of the choices that you make throughout the space of the day, there aren't, you know, um, it's not a big deal or it, it doesn't mean much. It does because ultimately it's what's guiding okay, the direction of your life. And you, you, I don't feel like you're aware that the universe here is presenting you with choices. okay. And it's more than just one choice, which I feel like is what's adding to your confusion here. The universe is presenting you with choices, decisions, certain people, certain possibilities of opportunities. And these choices and these possibilities and opportunities that you're being presented with have been accumulating, okay? And they are ultimately adding up to your destiny and they are ultimately leading you to your destiny. And these choices or decisions that the universe is presenting you with, and I can see there's a smorgasbord, okay? And for some of you, yeah, I get the anxiety, the confusion, the uncertainty that comes with it. Because for some of you, you're afraid to make the choice. Because what if you fail? You know, what if it doesn't work out? What if the, um, you know, what if it's the wrong choice or the wrong decision for you? So I can understand that there's, you know, with the presence of the moon, um, water energy here, I can understand that there's some hesitancy. You have some doubts, you have some reservations, there's uncertainty. Um, you know, there's no guarantees in life, but let me tell you that there are so many choices or decisions that, um, and just options and opportunities that have been presented to you that are ultimately adding up for you and have been adding up for you for quite some time, and they're ultimately leading you to your destiny. And you can absolutely create this life of abundance and prosperity um, and love, okay? And let me tell you, even, you know, 
just going back to this energy of uncertainty because for some of you I feel like you've been there's something here that you're wanting to get started okay and for some of you it could it might seem something very small and maybe it's something you've been putting off for others of you it might be a very big bold and drastic move like packing up your life and moving over to the other side of the world or deciding to change you know make a significant career switch um, or deciding to give someone um, a chance that you maybe otherwise wouldn't have there is no wrong choices I don't think so so in a way you can't fail um, it's going to the wrong choice you know is going to help you grow personally it's going to help you even the wrong choice is a part of your journey of personal growth, okay? It's going to help you grow. It's going to push you outside of your comfort zone. And sometimes the wrong choices, okay, or the wrong ones lead us to the right ones. So don't be, you know, take that step. Take a leap of faith here. And I feel like what you need to do, because I feel, you know, for, for a lot of you, I feel like you're just, you're not certain, okay? And what's ultimately, you are what's holding you, you back here, okay? You're what's holding you back. You're what's sort of preventing you from leading out your destiny because you're getting a lot of signs and you're getting a lot of synchronicities from the universe okay and you know you've got this wonderful this absolutely wonderful combination of tarot cards here um you know the two of pentacles is you going back and forth on this choice or decision that needs to be made and ulti ultimately i feel like it's symbolic of this crossroads that you're at okay um and you know what here's the thing about choices or decisions that regardless of whether you commit to a choice okay of whether you do this or do that every choice and even if you don't choose every choice has a consequence it has ensuing consequences so if you choose or if you choose not to choose that too is ultimately a choice and it will have some consequences so I feel like don't be scared to make this decision because ultimately it might just be the best decision you've ever made. Even if it's something, you know, big, bold and drastic. I don't think you can fail because I feel like this is interwoven into your destiny, okay? Um, and you don't understand the doors, the windows that are going to open for you. And when you're in alignment with your true purpose and what it, your passion and your soul's purpose, when you're in alignment with the universe, um, everything has a natural flow to it. And I feel like some of you you know, you can attest to this, especially with the most recent turn of events for you. Everything just kind of fits right. Everything just starts working out effortlessly. And for a lot of you, you know, there's so much abundance and prosperity. And I'm not only talking about financial gains, although there is that too. I feel like for some of you, you know, there are job offers and career paths that are going to open up and make themselves available to you and that are going to offer you a lot of prosperity and a lot of, you know, financial security and abundance. But it's what I see for you is this happiness. It's this It's this, how do, I des how do I describe it? It's it's what you should have been doing all along, okay? And it's the person that you should have been with all along. It's just this, it's your destiny is what it is. I feel like that's the best way to describe it. It's fate, it's destiny. Um, I feel like the universe wants you to choose. This is why you've been presented with, and this is why you have so many different choices and options, because I feel like the universe wants you to make a choice. It doesn't want you to be stagnated, because for some of you, you've been stagnated. You've been stuck. You've been where you're at for quite some time. I think you can agree, right? And there hasn't been a lot of growth, right? Because you've been comfortable in what you think is your comfort zone, but it's not really your comfort zone, because um, I can see it hasn't been serving you positively. And, you know, growth happens outside of this comfort zone. And for a lot of you, yes, this choice or decision that you have to make, it's going to change your life forever in a very big, in a very profound, in a very instrumental way, but in a very positive way. Okay. And even if you think it may be the wrong choice, I don't know that there is such a thing as a wrong turn okay, or the wrong choice, because at the end of the day, you know, we learn and we grow and it's all part of your personal development. So you know what? I'm here to tell you that it's okay to be confused. I'm here to tell you that it's okay to be scared and it's okay to not be okay. It's okay to, um, you know, it's okay to sort of be realistic, I guess. Be realistic about your choices and decisions that, yes, you might, you know, 
you might fall in love with the wrong person or you might end up going, um, you know, you might pack up your life to go overseas and it might not necessarily work out according to your, pl um, to your plan or it might just work out even better. So don't let, you know, it's okay to be scared. It's okay to be fearful. Um, but that's what courage is, you know, courage is being afraid, but doing it anyway. So I'm here to tell you that it's okay to have this fear. It's completely normal. And I feel like it's a good thing because when you have this fear, I feel like it's telling you that something is worthwhile, is it not? So whatever choice or decision that you, you know, you've been giving it a lot of your energy, but not in a way that I feel like has been serving you. What do I mean by that is because you've just been going back and forth and you're trying to convince yourself this way and you're also trying to convince yourself that way. You, and you haven't made a decision. And I don't think you'll ever make a decision, not in this kind of energy state. Um, you need to listen to that. You need to pay attention to the emotions that you get, you know, when you think about this choice or decision that you have to make, or when you think about this move that you have to make, okay? Pay attention to the emotions. So, you know, if it feels good, if you feel a sense of peace, and if you feel like, yep, you know, this is what fits, this is what you should be doing. Ultimately, you know, sorry, and on the other flip side of the coin, if you feel uneasy about some of those choices, we'll explore those emotions too. You know, probe them. Why is it that you're feeling this way? Because let me tell you, your life, you're on the edge of a precipice and your life is about to change in a very big, in a very powerful, in a very positive way. But you're going to have to be the one that's going to make that change. And, and it starts with the choice, okay? And it may start with what you think is the smallest choice or decision. But ultimately, you know, the direction that our lives take all begin with the choices that we make on a daily basis. And... There's a reason why you're feeling uncomfortable right now. There's a reason why you're not happy or you might be content but not overly satisfied. You know, there's a reason why you're feeling because, you know, there's emotions because it's true. You are destined for something bigger and you are destined for something better. And it's ultimately, it'll start with the choice. So this back and forth has been draining you. Four of Swords energy, I can see. Um, you know, Wheel of Fortune, this is, I feel like this is a reminder. This is a reminder that you have a destiny to fulfill okay um, you are destined to find love you are destined to um, you know be the very person you've always wanted to be and become you are destined to have to fulfill that you know dream of yours um, you know the sun card there's just so much happiness and prosperity and abundance that lies honestly it's as close as your fingertips all you have to do is reach for it okay four of swords you need to you need to pull reel your energy back in and focus on you Okay, um, you need to make a decision or a choice, but it needs to be one that you feel good about. Okay, if it drains you or if it doesn't, you know, if you don't feel good about it, that's probably a sign that the choice or decision is not for you. The King of Wands here is, a telling, is, is here to tell you to, to take action, you know, because having all these decisions and having all of these ideas, yeah, it's great, but what use of it, what use is it if you're not going to do anything with it, true? Um, and the moon card here, I get it, you're, I get it, you're upset, I get it, you're worried, I get it, you're anxious, and you know what, you have every right to be, because no, there aren't any guarantees in life, but you know what, there is such a thing as a fate or a destiny that awaits you, and this is yours, it starts with this choice of decision that you've been sitting on for quite some time, I think now is time, and I think that's what the cards are telling you, now is the time to... Make that choice a decision that is going to alter your life forever. And these are your messages. Thank you guys so much for watching and listening. Please show your support by liking, sharing and subscribing. Bye.